Hi, me again, Moth Hunter. You saw me in my pantry, dining room pantry, and I showed you some West Elm shelves. I should have lifted them up because here's what I found. This is Katie the Moth Hunter. If you've just seen this episode randomly, I'm cleaning my closet and I'm finding a bunch of moths. All right, if you saw the episode before this one, you know that that has been a moth party. That is an active, uh, moths are eating it and making cocoons. We saw that there's a moth right there. He's a little cocoon. Um, okay, he's gonna come out of there. Or he already came out, I'm not sure. I'll go really close for you if you haven't seen the previous episode. So, that right there, gross, right? Okay, oh. Here are my West Elm shelves and I lifted one up and underneath it was one single dog food pebble and around it are three, maybe four cocoons. And I will try to point to you. Let me see if I can situate anything. How can I balance? Okay, hold on. Here we go. Okay, I wish I had a pointer. Not my finger. Here's a knife. Good thing I have all this silverware in this thing. Okay, that is a cocoon. That is a cocoon, that is a cocoon, and right behind it is a cocoon. So they're all of different sizes, but they're all feeding off of that um, dog food pebble. Just one single pebble. So you know what that means, you guys? It means that other moths came and laid eggs, I guess, I think, inside of that dog food, um, per that, just that one pebble. And then they hatch, you know, they're on their food. I think this is how it works. They're on their food and they just eat right away and they become what they become moths and then they fly around trying to probably go back there and lay their eggs right back there on some food so okay so while i have you i'll lift it up because that's going in the trash yeah so there's another one same thing wow yeah i see another like flat cocoon i guess maybe that one's done I'll lift it up, see what's under it. More kernels. Artisan wine shop, obviously we shop there. Put that away. Okay, Um. yep, just all this dog food. So that was a real big culprit in here, was stray dog food. Hmm. Okay. So I think we're getting to the end of this closet and we can just say that the stray dog food, I'm gonna say a total of five dog pebbles. Oh, and those Girl Scout cookies, Dolce de Leche or whatever, like very flowery ones, were the culprits of this moth invasion. So there you have it, folks. Get to the bottom of it. All right, this has been The Moth Hunter. Catch these on YouTube. Just uh, maybe Google like hashtag moth hunter, hunter and you'll find a bunch. Okay, talk to you later, bye.